Hey developers! At Christmas Eve, my channel reached 10,000 subscribers. I was supposed to do a 10,000 subscriber celebration video then, but the number of subscribers started to grow very fast, so now we are here at 15,000 instead. A first world problem in other words. For me, running such a specialized channel about something with such a relatively narrow subject as PLC programming, it's just a great joy to read so many people. I recently finished and published the last part of the Twinkia 3 PLC programming course, and even though it was a lot of fun making these videos, I have to be honest and say that I've looked forward to finish it so that I can take a tiny rest and start with a new project. Something new. Anyway, waking up on Christmas Eve and getting the 10,000 subscriber was a great Christmas gift. Not as great as these nice socks that I got from my mother-in-law, maybe, but yeah, almost as good. I was actually awake and by the computer when I reached the 10,000 subscriber and this is how it looked like when the number 9999 changed to 10,000. Yeah, this was what I was afraid of. <clears throat> Either this or... <gasps> yes! Yay! Yay! Cele 10,000 subscribers! Thank you very much every subscriber! I thought I'd go through some of the questions I've been receiving lately. And the first one is, are you Polish, Swedish or German? Ja jestem urodzony w Polsce, w Stalowej Woli, ale ja się przeprowadziłem do Szwecji, jak miałem 3 lata, z całą rodziną. Są mi trzy osoby, flytia do Sverige, na mnie bestem Stockholm, da ja je upwekst o buty i over 35 år. Ja åkte po et spennende jobb til Tyskland, da ja treffa min fru o da ja nu bor. I moment lebe ich in München mit meiner Frau und arbeite an meinem Deutsch. Es ist eine schwere Sprache. In other words, I'm born in Poland, raised in Sweden, currently living in Germany. Now that the Twinka 3 course is finished, what is the next step? I of course have stuff I would like to make videos about, but I'm also open for what you, my viewers, want to see. I received more suggestions than I have fingers and toes to count with. Here I have to be quite selective, for the simple reason that it, it, it just takes a lot of time to make every video. As I counted the hours I spent on the Twinka 3 course, I have it black on white that it takes about one hour of work for every minute of video, including all aspects of the video creation. The suggestions I've received are ranging from doing a course for motion control, safety, Twinka HMI, analytics, about various bank of hardware, and yeah, also suggestions that I should stop making content about bank of and Twinka and focus on other platforms such as Alan Bradley or Siemens. I have some ideas on what I want to focus on, and I'll keep you updated here on the channel. Please leave a comment below for what you would like me to make content about. The third question is, can you help me with Twinka 3 programming? Again, this comes back again and again, and even though I would like to help every single person on this planet with PLC programming, my time limitations restrict me in how many I can help. I think a forum like Stack Overflow for questions is more appropriate. Not just because it saves me time, but also because many more people than you and me get to see the answer. If you however do want my help, I've started my own company where I'm offering services related to PLC programming. We have a link in the video description below. I just wanted to thank you so much for watching my videos and I'll keep making content for you as long as you don't get tired of me. I have some new and interesting content coming up, so if you haven't already, please subscribe to this channel to get notified of when that is released. I also want to take the opportunity to say that I would really appreciate if you would consider becoming a patron. You have a link in the video description below. As I've traditionally done, I want to finish this video by opening one of these party poppers up, again making a mess in this room and uh, quickly vacuum cleaning it afterwards before my wife sees this mess. So yeah, here we go. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Thank you very much.